guys welcome or welcome back to my channel thank you so much for finding me my name is Chrissy and today is Tuesday and that means I've got a haul for you I haven't done one really for the last couple of weeks because there's not been much about but if you'd like to see what I've brought please stay tuned so guys as you know it's been absolutely crazy for the last few weeks the post has been understandably slow which I don't mind but I haven't been able to get some stuff but I've got this for you today now this is May's glossy box. It was the I think it wild thing, wild thing edition. This one was the zebra one. There was also a leopard one because there's a lot of people on YouTube do a lot of box and openings with glossy box as well. So I'll just run through them with you and tell you what they all are and how much they were supposed to be. So we there. How is everybody? Have we had a nice weekend? Let me know in the comments down below if you've actually been able to do anything special inside the house obviously um it is explore your wild side you, you either got this one which i had or this one here that's leopard uh tree. so the first thing we've got is this um sos printed sheet mask this is from okay this is retailing at four pound I actually got the Dalmatian one. Next is an EOS lip balm, which these retail at £6.50. I got the mint one. Uh, next is from Mud Masky. This is a hair mask scalp treatment and miracle shampoo, which it's unusual for Mud Masky to do a shampoo. I've only ever had sort of masks before, so I am actually interested in um looking at this and i might use this later this retails at 21 pound and that's full size so that is a lot of money for 75 mils uh the last but one is a glitter eye pencil from stargazer there was a choice of six colors and i had the silver one which is very nice I don't mind a silver eyeliner and that can go straight in my big foldable book. And the last thing is an eyeshadow palette from Steve Laurence. Now this retails at £31. Now that to me that is a lot of money for a £9 palette. Let's just open it and show you. Is the colourway. It's alright. It's a neutral palette. It's quite similar to what I've got on today. Um, but yeah. It's, it's just an everyday uh, palette book. So that is your glossy box. Short and sweet. I think it was worth about £70 this time. So it's usually around in between 50 and 70 anyway. So that wasn't too bad. I found these at Asda. Now these are, I'm hoping they're going to be small enough to go in my Alex drawers I'm not 100% sure looking at them there they might they look a bit deep but these were on special at two pound by the Wham Studio tray 5.01 um so there's that one at two pound they've got them in this colour they've got them in like a dusky pink colour and they've also got them in grey I didn't get the grey but I thought I think I've got four of these now and then when I went the other day, they've got this size as well. So that is a nice size. Of course, I've took the stickers off these now. But these was £1.50 as well. But they're, they're a nice sturdy plastic. And uh, I thought, well, I'm a bit obsessed with, obsessed with, I'm a bit obsessed with everything in life. The bottom ones are one, uh, two pound and the top ones are one pound fifty i think they're they're on sale but they're only like about 50 pence off it anyway so those are from asda next up i'll go and show you what i brought from alza and the first thing is this 100 percent naturally derived eye cream enriched with shea butter and coconut oil now this was i think it was either 1.99 or 2.99 it is the vegan range it's in the brown boxes if you see them um they're the half price i don't think they're selling as good as they expected them to but this is 30 mil so even for two pound or three pound i think that is a really good price and it's really soft on your eyes as well i did look at them on full price and i thought no i'm gonna wait for them to come down because i wasn't sort of desperate for an eye cream but it smells 
really fresh. The next one I was there, they've got these on offer as well. I think these was only two pound or three pound as well. They're, they're, they're concealer pens. I got the I mean two shades. I brought um, Savannah, which is number two hundred, and Cashmere, which is uh, number one hundred. Savannah is a little bit more pinky than cashmere, if you can see. It's very similar to this Revolution one I've got. So it's a click a click a pen. And then the product just comes out of the tip on a brush. And then you can just add as much exactly where you want to um, with the tip of the pen. I do like these. I've actually... I'd even forgot I'd got this one. I might start using this, but I don't really wear a lot of concealer. Perhaps I ought to. Those are the three things from Alze. Very cheap. They're reduced. So if you do come across them, you know, it's it's nice to have a, a bit of a bargain, isn't it? Right, next we're going on to eBay. So last week, I think I think it was last week or the week before, I mentioned that I was going to try and get some neon eyeliners. Well, I managed to get these. These, you can either buy them separate or you can, I think, at about £1.50. Or you can actually buy them as a set of seven. Now, I will put the price up on screen. The nice and pink, the magenta, the blue, the floro orange, the fluoro green, red and fluoro yellow. Next is, next and last is, at last I've had my Morphe order. Now I'm waiting for another one to come as I'm filming this. If it comes, oh it should be coming today. I've had a notification that's coming today. The first thing I had, don't laugh at me. Because I said I'd never order this because of all of the all of the controversy of this lad. I've had the large Jonas Charles palette. Now there was no way I was going to pay thirty nine pound for it, but it came out and it was eighteen pound or twenty pound. So I had it. It's a thirty nine pound palette and no mirror. A huge palette. But this is the palette. It's obviously, it's the ultimate rainbow palette, really. You've got uh, some shimmers and some mattes in there. It's nothing to write home about, about, I don't think. But I thought I'd have it and I've got it in my collection then. So I always know that if I want a rainbow palette, I've got one. I have got plenty, in fairness. So I thought, well, I'll buy it because it's art price. I've been waiting for this a while. I've put it in my basket, I've took it out, I've put it in, I've put it out. So it is the 35M Boss Mood Palette. And £15, I thought that was a really good price. That's obviously why I had it. Um, that's 35 and that's 39 So that sort of gives you an idea of the size difference. That is the palette. I can't come any closer because of the ring light. Um, there is a lot of shimmers. I'm gonna, I will come closer just for you to see, but you are gonna see my ring light. Just to see some of the colours. So it's just to give you an idea. Like I say, it's sort of, it looks like it's a pretty 50-50 split, mattes and shimmer. Uh, next, I brought a con continuous setting mist. Now I've heard this is supposed to be really good. This was down to eight pound, plain white bottle. But I thought I'd give it a go and let you know how I get on with it. A lot of people say it is really good. So I do like my high, high art revolution setting sprays, as you may know. But uh, it's always good to give something else a try. <laughs> I did only send for one of these. It's the um, the actual sponge. It's the Highlight and contour sponge, uh, but they actually sent me two, and I thought it might be a part of a set. But when I've looked, I was only supposed to have one, so that's a bit of a bonus for waiting so long for my products, which is great. Out and the pout lip kit. This one is in fiery red, so it comes all that sort of like this. I've had to keep these in the box just so I could show you before I use them. 
So we have a lip liner, we have a gloss, and then we have a bonnet lipstick. Let's just show you the colours. So those are the three colours. I think it's always nice to have a, a red lip or liner in your collection. I think because you're always going to be wearing it for one time and all of them. Now this I had for £13. Now this is called the I Obsessed Brush Collection. 12 pieces plus the bag. And I had those for £13. £13. I ripped the hand off as soon as I saw it. I did, I had it and it was in my basket, it was paid for. I'll tell you what we've got in here. A large shadow fluff brush, a blender brush, a pointed blender brush, firm blending fluff brush, small chisel fluff brush, smudge brush, pointed crease brush, detail crease brush, concealer brush, flat liner brush, detail liner brush, angled brow spoolie brush and a zipper bag. So it is 12 pieces. Uh, 12 pieces for £13. I've got my parcel. Oh, right, let's have a little look. These are the last two items I've been waiting for from Morphe. So we've got the Jeffrey, Morphe Jeffree Star Iconic Bolds and Iconic Nudes Lippies. They're the mini lipsticks. These were supposed to be £24 each, but the offer they was had got on, it was 60%, and so I got both sets for £28.80. I got 10 lipsticks there, Jeffree Star, Morphe, so that's like less than £3 each. So I think when you sort of weigh it up, that was a damn good buy. I'm going to show you them anyway. In these sets, you get two original Jeffree Star minis and then you get three Morphe, Morphe and Jeffree Star um, lip glosses. What I'll do is I'll swatch all of them and then I'll tell you what they are. This is the Iconic Nudes collection. So first off you've got Mannequin, then you've got Leo, those two the original Jeffree Star then you've got a lip gloss in Star Crown. You've got a lip gloss in First Impressions, which just looks like a clear lip gloss to me. And then you've got a lip topper in Slurp, which is a gold shimmer lip topper, which will look really nice on either of these. We've got these two again are Jeffree Star Originals. So you've got Unicorn Blood here. Then you've got Red Rum. Then Berry Blast is the lip gloss. Then you've got Iconic, which again looks like a, a very clear lip gloss, but with a hint of pink. And then a lip topper, which is gorgeous in living for it. Now this lip topper looks to be a pink shimmer, pink iridescent shimmer. So those are all the shades, which they are really, really pretty. It's just something that I wanted to try and it was a good opportunity to try them at a really good price. So guys, that is the end of my haul. I hope you've uh, got this far. I hope you've enjoyed what I've got. If you have, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up. That would be amazing. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and you do like my videos. I will see you again on Thursday. I've got another collection for you. Stay safe, guys. Love you loads. Watch what you're doing. Bye, guys. <laughs>